what's up guys welcome back to another episode of satisfactory update 7 this is episode 44 uh for this episode we'll be continuing some work on the weapons factory we're still doing some other stuff around the piece if you guys are new to the channel uh if you guys are if I like and hit subscribe if you guys are interested in satisfactory content Release satisfactory videos every Saturdays at 10 a.m. EST. All videos are pre recorded either Wednesdays or Thursdays, depending on my free time. Uh, first and foremost, what we're going to do this episode, we're going to expand the weapons factory to be optimized just a bit. Uh, let's see how much rebar we have so far. We have 95, we need 200 for the explosive rebar research. And a couple smoke glass powder. I don't know what the explosive rebar is gonna take to build. So, what the fr why, why are you up there? So, before I even think of that, let me head back down to the main base. I'm gonna head back to the main base and see what we can get there let's see what the um explosive rebar needs to be made that's where the lag there uh, right over in that cave that you can see across it that's where the uranium is and we're just flying past the train i may actually add another station to the train stop to drop out the smokeless black powder down to the um that area weapons factory I know we're back at the main base Oh, I need to go get fuel. Oh, frick. Keep forgetting to do that. I got fuel for my jetpack. <coughs> That's a weird pouch. Um, some of the power stations are working, some are not, it doesn't really matter to me right now. I am going to look into optimizing the fuel and stuff later on for that. Let me just check and see if there's another way I can... So I think there's another way to optimize the... Production. Okay, so that doesn't, um... Takes oil to make fuel and petroleum. It goes straight to fuel. So I could take from the oil and change that into fuel. Interesting. That's an interesting perspective. If I ever run out of fuel, I can actually switch oil straight to fuel, but I will have a byproduct of um, the petroleum coils, which I can then turn into 
back into plastics. I do have a lot of oil. Hmm. That is an interesting perspective. I may actually do that later on. Just thought of an insane idea. Why don't I use these to turn oil into fuel? Wait, let me see the difference between the fuel production from these. Let me see if I produce more fuel. This gives me four cubic meters per minute, I think. 4 cubic meters every four se every six seconds. Uh, this one gives me same amount, but with a byproduct of the petroleum resin, poly resin, polymer resin, whatever. Um, which we can then turn into plastics or rubber. And I, I think I will have to switch over this whole thing because I need the um, heavier residue to go to the smokeless black powder factory. And but I still need fuel to go to the uh, fuel power plant, so I'd have to separate this by changing the fuel refineries to use oil. It's funny how before we had um, we had it set up that way before, but we changed it because you was getting the um, plastics and stuff faster when it's in this configuration. Now that we need uh, more fuel and we need resin, not resin, and we need um, heavy oil residue for different stuff. We are going to have to set it up differently again. Have it half half. The ones that are producing every oil residue are all going to go up to the up to the um sec up to the smokeless black powder area. Just this. Yeah, as the ones with just the the ones that are producing the resin. It's gonna not the resin one that's producing. Basically, it's going to go straight from oil to fuel instead of going to plastics and then to fuel. And I'm going to have more. Whoa, cheese truck. Should have more um, FUI residue on this side now. we need to sort out our um, fuel issue before we 
expand anymore. We're gonna have to fix this in advance. Because we can't um, expand because we run out of power if we expand with the current setup of our power grid. Uh, let's see. We do have a bit of fuel stored, so I should be able to do stuff. It's the oil line. Should have a split off right here. Okay. Can run this on this side here and run it up to the other two. Should have enough on me to do that. an abundance of oil so that's why I'm doing it this way okay it's gonna go wrong wait Just turn that suck and then this out there. Nice build more than auto. Ah. Ah, I guess it's only auto. Uh, see, I think I can get it to reach this little lip here. Yeah. Then I'm going to take the edge here. today because we may add more um, more in the future not today um Why are you trying to even go there? Oh my god, why? Are you kidding me? this without having to attach it to a pipe. See if we can align it properly. Actually forgot that I can do that. I 
And all we have to do for now is change the recipes of this one to uh, this. I should produce fuel, but we'd have a byproduct of the resin, which we have to make more refineries to turn that resin into plastic and actually use that to turn that into rubber because we have more plastic uh, production once on the other side. Because we have, I think we only have two rubber production refineries, whereas we have, out of the eight, we have six. That is doing plastics. But for now, before we uh, make those guys to switch that over, because we need to pull water again back down here. Before we do that, I don't know if this pipe here. Before we do that, we're just gonna build a. Okay, game. Thanks for lagging. We're gonna build a. Oh, I need to go get the. I have to go for steel anyway, so that's a small one just now. That pool there. This is so freaking hard. Kidding me. Are you freaking kidding me? In God game, work for once. Just gonna pull up a temporary thing here, and it's like, nope, I'm not gonna work. Trying to load, jeez. Just temporary, so that the red and one back up. And the um, refineries. All right, so that's it for.
was like, why is that still? I'm gonna go with tree. That should keep emptying those guys and put it in storage. I have to figure out what I'm doing with that uh, later on. Should help us with fuel for now, even though it's the same amount that we was producing before, but we don't have to wait for the heavy oil residue to use the oil. To use the FUO residue, I just heard some noise in the background, so I was figure what it was. So now we don't have to wait for the FUO residue in, to turn it into um, this thing. To turn it into fuel, we're gonna go straight directly from oil into fuel. Just reconnect us here. It's just gonna help us both ways. Um, we have to figure out what we're gonna do with the remainder, with the um, polymer resin that's now being produced from the oil. Uh, because in order to turn the the um, polymer resin into plastics or rubber we need water so I have to build another water station but as you can see we got this thing running last episode and we give it a bit of a beef this episode also should be full yeah in 20 per minute 40 per minute because you have two and this is already almost full rip i think we needed like 200 small glass bar powder for the research 200 uh steel beams and 200 rebar so let's go get the steel beams by the time we reach up to the rebar factory the weapons factory it should have enough for us to make the to research the um what do you call it explosive rebar i don't even think i unlocked the rebar gun Let's see. I'm gonna go upstairs. I'm gonna go right into the back room here. So I can get you my noodle of a configuration there. Over here. Should have. Oh, it looks like I don't. Interesting. Why are you lacking in. Bars. I need to clean these down containers up. Like, why is there not enough? Wow, I haven't visited this factory so long that I have no idea what's going on. At least there's 200 there. Okay, nice. Ah, uh, let's see. Ah, yeah, coal is a problem, apparently. Because I switched coal over. A to a train and server truck. Well, I was meaning to go back to the main factory, but jeez. Let's 
It's apparently coal is a problem for the steel production, but we're not using steel that much right now. So we don't have to worry about the production of that right now and optimizing that. Well, let's just head back to the main factory. Uh, then we're gonna go upstairs and head down to the weapons factory to get the 200 rebar that we needed for the research. And figure out how we're gonna build the explosive rebar. Is that this one? It's this one I got. I need to figure out some more uses for rubber. So as of right now, we only use rubber for the one of these. What was it? We was using rubber for the automatic. So the one of the materials we needed for the space elevator phase three is what we were using rubber for. I forgot which one it was. So hopefully we get another use for rubber so that I can uh, lessen it down. Hi big guy. Not to worry about him again because yeah, I put you connection now. I was I just remembered. I forgot to tell you guys this last episode. Uh just added a new feature to for the patrons support the channel. Patrons will now get access to all my save files from episode one up to the latest episode. I will be updating every time I record a video. I do have save files for every single episode. So I create a new save file every episode. So patrons, you guys can get access to the Save first and you guys can play around and see how you can change anything that I did between episodes. Okay, wow, we have so much rebar. I thought we had less than this. Um, I need to dump some of this fabric. Why do I have this on me? I do have so much bush on me. Much biomass. Alright, that should be enough for the research in to unlock the explosive rebar. I don't even think I have the rebar gun. Whatever. We'll be testing that out uh, later on. Once I get everything automated. Uh, as you can see on the top, the right hand corner of the screen, that's the next phase of the space elevator. I don't know what that's gonna unlock, but that's a lot of shit. Like, 4,000. Of stuff that I haven't even made before. And I don't even know how to make. That's some hefty goals.
welcome back to the trip audience from the uh quick build montage there i don't mind interruption in between but yeah uh so a quick brief on what we did uh we added a new train station to the quartz and south line now we have a train that's stopping off just in between to drop off the smokeless black powder and the steel um pipes that we need to make explosive rebar so it's dropping those off to the explosive to the weapons factory we have over here we did start putting up some walls in the weapons factory but i ran out of concrete and stuff here comes the train uh i ran out of concrete and stuff so next episode we'll be continuing where we left off this episode uh putting the walls and start manufacturing explosive rebar now, so that train should stop there. It should unload the last two crates, which would be the exposed, should be the steel pipes and smoke glass back powder. And then head off to the sulfur mine to get more sulfur. So officially now this is going to be the longest train we have on the in the C file in the world. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the uh, episode. As usual, if you guys want to see more, don't forget to drop a like and hit that subscribe. I release satisfactory videos every Saturdays at ten am est pre-recorded on wednesdays or tuesdays depending on my free time to record um also on another note i am going to start working on a couple in a week or two so i'm not too sure how the recording schedule and stuff is if it's going to change at all but i'll let you guys know on twitter if the recording schedule is going to change and how the videos are going to be released based on my work schedule um yeah so hope you guys enjoyed remember if you guys want to get access to any of the uh discussions we did during the uh during the build montage sessions of the videos if you guys want to get access to that feel free to support the channel on patreon where you guys can see the full recording session and also get access to the save files for each episode of the series from episode one to this episode i'd have a link down in the description below for you guys to get access to that i um, hope you guys enjoyed i'll see you guys in the next one i'm out peace